Hi guys! Oh my goodness, it has been forever since I last vlogged, um, but I thought I would today, since I'm kind of free in a way, um, I am uploading a video right now because it's time to get back into uploading videos. Um, Liam's back at school and yeah so uploading right now i'm so excited to finally have a video up for you guys like real soon um i looked and the last time i uploaded was like in may and that's just crazy because it just i don't know it just went by so fast like this entire summer i seriously thought that i would be back like after our trip but it's just so busy like this is the busiest summer ever so i actually did film before our italy trip so i have footage from that too like i believe i filmed like a pack with me hauls for the trip all of that so let me know down below if you want to see that um i think i will like i don't know name those vlogs like I don't even know like rewind I don't know something because it's from months ago but let me know if you want to see those vlogs I can kind of like do them in order just so it would kind of make sense um but anyways I thought I would do my makeup with you guys and just kind of catch up I did get some new makeup too um you guys know me I'm a creature of habit so I'm using a lot of the same stuff I did get like refills of a few things oh i got this recently i don't like it so i'm actually gonna throw it out this is the cover fx the total cover cream foundation so i got it in the color m1 and it's actually my actual color but this summer i'm literally like two or three shades darker than normal so um i can't use that but anyways i don't like it i just really don't so i will throw that out um i'm still using this by dior still using the dior foundation but i got the new stick version so this guy it's so cool literally gives me the same um finish and all of that like the foundation so i'm excited that they came out with the stick because it's just so much easier um to use for application for travel for everything i love stick foundations um so i'm gonna finish my foundation like you know the liquid but i'm also have been using this since i got it and i love it once i'm done with that this is i think if this sticks around this is something that i will just like repurchase instead of the liquid so anyways this is the foundation i just got it it's really nice stick foundation just like that i am in the color 3n um it's a little light for me right now but it's workable because it is my true shade um this is my favorite uh what's it called primer so i always use this this is what i just applied in the beginning of this video anyways yeah i hope you're all doing well my goodness it has been forever i have a breakout right there Ugh. it's fine um like I mentioned, Liam is back at school. So it's like, okay, time to get back into our routine, have a actual schedule. And, you know, I can do stuff during the day. He's not with me 24 seven. I don't have to bring him to places like I did in the summertime. So kind of how my schedule is, I guess I can tell you, we wake up. I wake up super early in the morning coffee, breakfast, get Liam ready for school, drop him off, and then depending on the day, I go straight to the gym after drop off. And then I'm there for about two, two hours max. And then I go home, have lunch. I can do my work. Um, from noon to 2, I have like all that time. Sometimes I'm home by 11, so that's good. Um, because sometimes I, I get lunch with friends or brunch, I should say, with friends afterwards. So yeah, um, but I'm usually home by 11 and then I have all that time 
to work. Um, but I think later on this year, I will start working out from home, especially when it starts snowing and all of that. But right now I am enjoying going to the gym while I can and the driving isn't too terrible. I'm still enjoying working out and I wanna keep at it, especially after I paid so much for all the things. <laughs> Um, I'm still enjoying it, so yeah, I will, I actually haven't posted on Instagram in a while, like my, like an update, I usually do like a weekly, or not, not weekly, a monthly update, but I haven't um, since July, so I might do one soon, um, nothing much has changed, and I'm gonna be honest with you, the month of August, no, July, I kind of like slacked a little bit, and then August, I got a little bit better, so yeah. Um, and then now it's September, I'm really back at it. Now that Liam's back at school, I can focus on it a little bit more. And I mean, even then, I did bring him to the gym with me, but I felt bad, you know, having him stay at the daycare area. Sometimes he loved it because there's other kids, and there are times where he did not like it at all because he's the only one, or it's just babies that are in there you know so it's kind of well I felt like it's not fair for him to just like sit there and for like two hours you know so yeah it's just much better now that he's back at school and I can do this and I don't have to drag him with um force him to sit at the daycare anyways that's a life um we had a big party for Liam for his birthday which was great I don't even know if I filmed anything from that. Um, I think just stuff for Instagram. Like I had like a reels, but that was it. It was like a really busy day for us. And then a few days later, it was mine and Tom's 10 year anniversary. Can you believe it? We've been together, married for 10 years. Like that's, my gosh, just so crazy. Um, I still can't believe we've been together for that long. Anyways, oh, these puff things, I bought a bunch of them um, at TJ Maxx. I do wash them um, every, like, two weeks, but this is what I use to, like, apply my, my powder. Like, press it in instead of sponge. And these are so cheap, too. Like, you can get a pack for, like, a pack of 10 or something for, like, $6 at TJ Maxx so inexpensive so sometimes i just throw it out if i can't like get it super clean but yeah i like it so that's just what i use to apply my loose powder i'm still using i'm still using my hourglass translucent i i believe i repurchased this earlier this summer like a new one because i was out so that's that. Um, I did, since you can't get this anymore, this Dior Quad. I love, I love this. Since this is discontinued, I did purchase the the Dior bronzer, which is, oops, which is similar to, to this one. Which way is it? To this. It's pretty similar. That's what I use to contour. I'm still using this though, but yeah, I do have that for when this is out. Um, I do, let me see, I do my powder, my brows first, okay, so this is all gone, this is the Dior brow, I don't know if you can see that, there's like a tiny bit left, I love this brow pencil, one thing I don't like about it is that it is $35, and honestly, I think I've only had this for two months and it's already done. So there's not a whole lot in here. I did repurchase it though because I'm stubborn. But I think once the second one is done, I'm not going to buy it anymore because it's just too much. And again, it only lasted me two, two months, which the hourglass, my gosh, I've been using it for months. The hourglass, I feel like can last me half a year. And then there's like a annoying piece of brow just one 
So anyways, yeah, after I finish the new one of this, I'm just gonna get my, I'm gonna go back to Hourglass because I do like the Hourglass. And this one is more precise, but as you can see, it takes me a while to do it. That's one brow versus, this is the Hourglass. I love this. This has the shape. And see, I've had this for months, and it goes a long way. Like, I feel like with this one, I can do it much quicker. I don't know. So, yeah, I'm, I purchased a new Dior, but after that, I'm definitely going back to our glass because that's it. I'm done with that. <sighs> I did get a new Dior. I'm going to open it right now. I have it in dark brown. If you are wondering, because this one is just literally, it's like out. Let's see how much is in here. Oh, wow. There's that much in it. <laughs> Not a whole lot, but yeah. It lasts me like two months, I want to say. So anyways... This one still has a little bit left in there. Let me just draw it out. It's good if you want to be precise, though. That's why I was like, well, let me just repurchase it. Okay, anyways. I need to brush this out. And then for... Um, to set it... I still am using my Anastasia. This is probably expired. I don't know. And honestly, I really don't care. Because it's still... There's still product in there. It's just a clear brow gel. But Anastasia, it's old. Okay. Alright, so for blush, I've been loving these guys from Dior. So I was using, for the longest time, Rose Rosewood. But then I recently got this like last month and I love it so much. This is called Bronze Glow. So you can see it's a brown and it does have a little bit of shimmer. It's so pretty, especially now, right now I'm tan. It just looks much better to me and you can see it versus the other one. I'm so tan that you couldn't even see it for so long. I'm getting a little bit lighter though now that... I don't go out in the sun as much. Um, yeah. <laughs> I got so dark, like, just a few times that we went to the beach. It's so crazy. Even though I did apply sunscreen, okay? Like, I'm pretty big on sunscreen because I don't want to age. Because, you know, we're getting old. Um, but, yeah. So, anyways. What else am I forgetting here? Oh, I don't... Oh, it's right here. Ugh. I had packed uh, some away because I went out of town yesterday, so yeah. Okay, so I'm still using this powder. This is the Dior. I don't even know if they sell this anymore. This is the Dior Nude Air Powder. I have it in the color 30. I'm still using it, but I only use it to like lightly set my face. I've already hit pan, so yeah, I don't even know if this is going to last maybe just the rest of the year, but I don't think you can buy it anymore. So once this is done, that's probably it. Um, let's see what else. I don't know. Oh, my mascara. Just curl my lashes. This is an old eyelash curler by Laura Mercier. I need to clean it for sure. I don't really do... Um, eyeshadow I will apply some bronzer but that's it like I take take this quad here Hold on. Pinch. <laughs> pinch my eye okay so I have this brush I'm gonna do my contour first I contour my nose because that's just what I do. Got a flat nose, so we need something there. 
like that. And then I take the lighter shade and I pop that all over the lid up to my brow bone really and just whatever is left. But yeah, see that's all that I do. Okay. Anyways, oh my gosh, I want to tell you guys, I had my first Pilates class today. Um, so I did, I was doing Pilates at the Y um, and that's without like the machine so we just use like a mat in that class and the ball and all that so very you know no machines at all so today i went to a different class and it's a reformer beginner class it was really fun i must say though it was kind of too easy for me but i'm gonna keep trying it and see and then um, maybe after two weeks of that, like at least four classes, I'm telling myself at least four classes of the easy, I'm going to bump it up to the next level, but we'll see. But it was a little bit, it wasn't hard. I was, I was wanting to like be sweating or something. I don't know, but it was fun. It was really fun. It was nice to go somewhere new and like see new people I, I don't know anybody there but I'm ready to make friends if anything and just be in a new environment and like try new things because I as much as I am a creature of habit I don't want to get bored and then all of a sudden like quit this whole journey and then like you know I don't want to lose my motivation and all that so I want to keep trying something new if I can so for this Pilates class I'm actually wanting to do it for like the rest of the year or at least three months I think is what I signed up for I signed up for three months and we'll see if I'll continue after that anyways lip balm I just got this color. This is um, pink lilac and it's so nice. I really like it. Um, I was using for a while since I got this one, the bronze glow. I also got the lip balm in this color in bronze, bronze glow and I really like that too. But lately, I love this. Um, I also got the blush for the pink glow match that I haven't used it yet but this is what it looks like it's just purple I don't have purple blushes I don't even know if they'll look good on me but I'm pretty excited to try that and then I got like two samples what is this your addict lip maximizer look how cute this is it was a um, gift with purchase look how tiny and then this is a foaming cleanser. Oh my gosh, it's so tiny. Good for travel, I suppose. Look at that. That's so cute. So, yeah, I got that. Oh my gosh, I've been blabbing for 15 minutes. I hope I did not bore you guys. So I'm going to take those out of the thing. This one will stay in there. But yeah, um, what else am I going to do today? I'm actually, after this... I'll bring you into my office. I do need to work on orders. I need to brush my hair out though. So let me put my stuff away and then we'll go in my office. And there's some new stuff in my office. I don't even think I showed you guys at all in any of the other vlogs that I will be uploading. But yeah, I'll show you a little bit of my office. Ooh. All right, this is my messy office. Oh, let the camera adjust. Okay, welcome to my office. A little dark, but here. Hopefully the camera will adjust. Here we go. So, I'm uploading. And on the floor right now is actually my new chandelier. I'm so excited to get that up. Um, my bookcase looking a little fuller. I think since I last showed it to you guys, I do need to declutter the boxes, the pink boxes. I feel like there are some stuff in there that I'm like, I don't need it. Um, yeah. 
but for the most part, I do love what's on my bookshelf though. Um, and then this, I actually did start decluttering already, but I need to do more. Um, I'm in this thing where like, I just want to keep what I really use and it's so hard. Okay. Uh, it's hard to get rid of stuff. So I need to try a little harder because there are still some stuff in there that I'm like, wow, I've had it for a long time and haven't used it. This cart is for my shop. It's, you know, I pull this out when I do orders. There's some stock on there and more shop stuff over there in a different cart. That's new products actually. <laughs> and then, um, this right here. Oh my gosh. I think I shared it with you guys before, but I'm not sure. Um, so yeah, Tom got me a TV. I'm so excited. So I can watch my shows here and just like have something playing in the background, which is nice for when I'm sitting here and whatnot. Um, I do have cute little ghost right now because, you know, Halloween. But yeah, that's just some decor there. And I do have books here and I do want to get more books. Like I want to fill it all the way to the top, but I'm not like just buying books. These are actually books that I like and I have read in the past. So yeah, right now I just have some decor to fill it. Um, isn't she so pretty? I found her at TJ Maxx. I think she's so cute and it's the perfect pink. But anyways, that's just what that looks like. I still have my mirror here. Hello. Um, and then in this area is where i work as you guys know i do want to get rid of this cd i feel like i want like just uh kind of like a low window bench with storage underneath uh because the cd goes up like halfway to the window and it does block light and you guys know me i love my light and i just feel like i need more storage because there's actually stuff under that <laughs> that I want to hide. So anyways, that is it. And uh, oh, hello. And you can see this looks the same. It's just a little messy right now because I am trying to catch up on journaling. I believe I am like a whole week behind now, a little bit over, I think, to be honest with you, um, because I just haven't had time since Labor Day weekend to like journal. So yeah. Like ever since after Labor Day weekend, it's just been like go, go, go again, trying to get into the swing of things with Liam going back to school and trying to, you know, figure out what I want to do for my workouts, where I'm going for my classes and stuff like that. So yeah, it's just been, oh, so anyways, that is it for now. I am going to be sitting here in my office for kind of like the rest of the day. I'm going to try to get some orders done. I think I have about six to do. Six or seven. I got two more yesterday, so nine. Um, Yeah, I'm a little, I feel like I'm behind because it's just been, ugh. So anyways, I'm gonna try to do that and then I'll check in with you guys again later. Hopefully, I keep forgetting. I feel like there are some footage where I'm like, I'm gonna vlog today, but then I don't, so. I'm gonna real. I'm really gonna try my hardest to vlog. But oh, here's a look on my my face. I hope it looks okay. I never do my makeup in um, the dining, <laughs> but like the lighting was a little weird. But this is just simple, kind of like everyday makeup. Like even if I'm going somewhere, <laughs> it's kind of what I do. Um, okay, so that's it. I'll check in with you guys again later. Bye. All right, so I had just gotten home from picking up Liam. So it's just a bit later, but I have here a package. Actually, I believe this arrived yesterday while I was gone. Um, I was out of town yesterday. I didn't get home till late. And I forgot that Tom brought in the packages and like it was kind of by the entryway. So this is actually my Hobonichi package so i posted my hobonichi haul which is the main thing so it's like really it's all mine um and i ordered all of that from atlas and then the next day i placed an order on hobonichi because there there is one thing that i really really wanted and then also i was like you know i need to on top of that buy a few things for vlogmas for a giveaway so let's see here i'm excited um this is 
one of the things I really, really wanted, and I will talk about it in a second. But I'm gonna just, there's so much stuff here because I've been working on orders. Cute little thing here. And then this is the Hobonichi box this year. Okay, I really like this dusty blue color. And I'm so excited that it was actually in another box because I have never gotten like a pristine package ever. They always just like ship it like this. So it always gets banged up and everything. So I'm really excited that I have a pristine box. I don't know if I'll keep it, but it's so cute. So anyways, I have a few things. So not everything that I ordered is for the giveaway. Majority of it are like it's not for me. Um, so anyways, let's just go ahead and see what's in here first. So I'm excited because yeah. Oh I'm sure you guys have seen the box, right? You can pause it right here. Hopefully that's um focused, but okay, so I'm gonna show you this. Yeah, everything that's in here is for the giveaway. I'm just going to go ahead and show you because I feel like if you've been watching my my videos and Vlogmas, um, during Vlogmas I do giveaways and a lot of the things that I do giveaways on are items that I personally love myself. Um, so yeah, I ordered the exact same stuff here so i will be giving away during vlogmas not right now um the hobonichi weeks you are gonna be twinsies with me i'm so excited and then of course i got the hobonichi touch show um original monday start english edition and the cover so we're gonna be twinsies whoever gets this i'm so excited to do this giveaway. I'm gonna actually keep all of this in this box just so it's nice and protected until Vlogmas. And because I ordered um, a touch show, A6, and also the Weeks, I got the free pens, which I never really use these, so I will be giving these away as well. So I'll go ahead and keep these in the box, but this is the color of the pen this year. So that is that. Oh my gosh, how exciting, right? I love that. I, you know, I love memory keeping. And if, and I know some of you, like, wanted to try. But I know some of this stuff is also, like, hard to get. And, like, you know, it's hard to invest money in something that you don't know um, you're going to actually do. So being gifted some stuff sometimes is nice. Because it's, like, you don't feel too bad if you kind of not do it you know what I mean does that make sense I don't know but I'm really excited to do giveaways on those um I think this Christmas will be the third Christmas that I'm giving away a like a Hobonichi something I'm not sure anyways these other items I got uh for myself um oh not these guys, I'm not sure. I think I'll put these in the giveaways as well because I already have one myself. But I went ahead and picked some up anyways because they are really just so much more affordable on the Hobonichi website, um, you know, compared to U.S. retailers. So I went ahead and purchased these as well. I will throw this in the giveaway because, again, I already have. Okay, so other things I got Spy Family stickers. And the Paddington sticker. So I was really almost like wanting the Paddington Weeks. But then I was like, no, I really love the Weeks that I picked. But I do love Paddington. And I decided, you know, let's get the stickers. At least this I can use for sure. And it comes in this cute little bag. Like a Ziploc bag thing that, you know, you can use. Or be used, but like isn't this so cute and I'm not sure how many stickers are in here but oh you can take the stickers out and the bag itself has this cute design how adorable so I would link these below because there's a few in there and I'm sure like you know it'll be better if you like go on the site and then like look at it up close and everything but I got the stickers and then of course got something from the spy family I really was wanting like all the things from Spy Family, but I'm like, okay, Charmaine, 
be realistic what will you actually use and I almost got the folders but then I was like I already have folders and I have extra folders that I haven't even used yet so I cannot I cannot get the folders so I opted out on getting the stickers because I know stickers I will use I was tempted to get the post-its as well but I was like I don't even think I'm gonna use the post-its so I'm like, alright, stickers. Stickers it is. So. Cute, cute, cute. So these are, oh, I like how this one has this. It shows you what stickers are in it. So you can kind of can pause and see there. Sorry about the lighting. I don't know. My camera just does that. Just like adjusts. See? Hello. Okay. Um, but yeah, again, with the cute little baggie. And then the stickers are inside. And the bag itself has these, um you know, design in gold. So pretty. I'm so excited. I love that. And then since I bought a Tacho, I get a freebie. So this is, I believe, a notebook. And there's three different kinds. Let's see what I got. <gasps> Ooh, I like it. Oh, I like this one. It was this or I think there was a green one that I really liked too, but I'm happy with this. I love this pink color. That's so pretty. And this is just graph paper. So that's really nice. I love that. I'm sure I will find a use for this and it is A6 size. <laughs> so go ahead and keep that. I'm so excited. It's funny because like I've ordered from Hobonichi before, but like I never actually order my like Techos and stuff from there. I think last year I ordered it off of like Atlas or something, so I didn't even get any of the freebies. Um, but yeah, I'm excited that I got a freebie this year. So these are super, super cute um, accessories. I kind of want to keep this, but there's like literally a sticker. For that except I don't think there's a sticker for that so I'm gonna keep this because I might cut that out I love Anya okay so this is the thing that I was like I need to place an order on Hobonichi because this is like one of the things I really really wanted to get you guys know me I love my journal pouches and I I feel like I've gone through so many I still have a ton um when I say I've gone through so many it's like I used it I thought it was perfect but then I go to use it again and I'm like not quite perfect um so it's like i'm still on a hunt for the perfect journal bag journal pouch i don't want anything too big i don't want anything too small i want to be able to carry it easily travel with it easily and all of that stuff and i was like this is so cute so i've been thinking about this I almost got the small one but then i was like realistically i would never use the small one because my a6 wouldn't even fit in that um, my weeks would I think but the a6 I don't think would at all so I was like no so this was my only kind of like option and I really love the hollyhocks pattern and you know during the release I I think this was one of the things that said it sold out when I was like trying to check out and the server kept crashing um yeah so this was one of the things that sold out and I was like can't like that's that was really the only thing that I couldn't get anywhere else you know what I mean so yeah anyways I saw it's back in stock so I bought it and I'm so excited and I believe this is $30 on the site so like that's not a bad price at all for like a little bag and it looks massive but it's really not like it's so cute. I love, I can't wait to like put all my stuff in here. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. Okay, so it's Velcro, as you can see, and it opens like this, which is so cute. And pockets. I love pockets for organization. Oh, I really like that there's this thing here too, so you can create more like a divider oh my gosh that's so cute i don't know if i'll need it but that's adorable so see now there's a divider right there and just so pretty i love the color of this it's so cute oh my gosh i'm so excited so let me show you what i'm currently using 
right now it's working but obviously it's like when i open it i'm like digging and it's not like awesome so hold on oh my gosh so i actually have so many bags for the longest time i was using this oh sorry it's like the lighting is weird so for the longest time i, I was using this and i i love this and I've actually already added all my pins on there. But, like, I really do like this one. And I just wanted something a little bit different, to be honest. Um, so, this is one of my favorites. And I think, to be honest with you, like, right now, I, I just have stored all of my stickers. So, this is, has been, like, staying on my desk. Because I, I need, like just a place to dump everything in so that's kind of what that's been like okay so anyways this is like my my printer right like i have all the other little printers but i love this one the most and i want to be able to bring it and this is this is what i've been using so i would carry this and then this and then this and it's just so hard to like lug around the house um also like if i visit my my parents i would bring this but like you know it's hard so i want like one thing so i'm hoping that this will fit in here somehow with all of, like all of this will fit in there crossing my fingers so i'll be back i'm gonna play around and then i'll let you guys know cross my fingers it works okay so it fits like this and I'm able to close it um one thing is that uh so for travel it will work which I'm so happy because I can shove more in there like I have the panorama right here and then I have a pen case which I usually just bring a small one for when traveling just a few pens and maybe a marker right now i just have pens in there this is my journal itself and i have my stickers right here and then i do have uh, i didn't put it in there i forgot but my scissors and tweezers i'm probably just going to shove in one of these pockets but that's pretty much it double go inside so let me, let me do this so like this if you See ya. I don't know. Oh, hello. I'm trying to make it so it goes down. It's a little weird. There we go. Alright. Okay. Much better. So, I have the panorama. I am going to put it this way because I realized this actually... You know, it closes like this, this shape. Even though you can have it so, like, it's more of a square like that. But I feel like carrying that is kind of not as secure as, you know, if it was all the way down on the actual Velcro. You know what I mean? Anyways, okay. Placing it like this on the side there. I have my stickers already in one of the pockets there. My journal. I did wish that it would fit this way, but it's okay. It can stand like that. That's pretty cute. And then, um, what was it? Oh, my pen case. This is a thin one, um, and it's actually just a two pen case, but there's like a back side that I'm, I'm able to do two more. So there's four pens in there right now. I usually don't bring fountain pens um, outside the house anymore. I just get so paranoid. But anyways, that's what that looks like. Okay, and then you just close it all the way. Like this side's a little bit up because of the because of my journal, but for the most part, it's pretty close. I think if I take these out, it would be okay, but I need my stickers, though. So. Yeah. I can always shove my stickers in the back pocket here. 
to make it fit better or close better because there is a pocket there so I have my stickers there so that's another way to do it but I'm really excited that my panorama along with my journal can fit in this I'm excited so during you know trips or weekend trips when I go home to my parents and I can bring this now and it's just one bag <laughs> it's always so hard to like have so much stuff but I'm really excited. I will probably gonna keep this like around the house too, just to like lug it around. But for right now, though, I'm home, so I have this pen case because I wanna sh I wanna use all the things. Actually, you know what? Let me shove all of this in here, and then we can see if I can fit it in here and close it. Let's see. I currently have four fountain pens inked up. I think there's more actually, but it's on my desk. What's that, baby? Oh, that's so cute. Aw, did you just do that? Yeah. What's that say? Mom. Mom. Oh, you're so cute. And this cute. is a crab and belongs to a cat king. Oh, my gosh. Look at it. <laughs> wow, babe. You're going to have to show Daddy later, okay? So this is my pen case for around the house because I just like to have everything in this little cute thing. I don't know if it's going to fit in here, but ta-da. Let's see if we can even close it. Probably not because it's so, look at it, so much stuff in there. <laughs> I mean, not too shabby. Manageable. I can totally. Oh, it's kind of. It's not bad. So I can use my big pen case too if I want. Cool. I'm happy with this. I'm glad I got this stepo. It's super cute. I love this pattern. I'm glad they came out with you know cute patterns. Um. Yeah. So excited. Yay. Okay, that's it for now. I have to keep working on orders. I have um, lots of stickers to cut. <laughs>